my channel. For today's video, we're going to have a taste test of the 1111 drinks. So if you're interested to know more about this video, then keep on watching. As you know guys, 1111 is owned by Heidi and Hazel. They do lifestyle vlogs here in YouTube. And today is the soft opening of their store which is located in Maginhawa Street in Quezon City. Yesterday, they opened up ordering for delivery and pickup today. All drinks are freshly made. Now, let's check on the packaging first. All the drinks come in plastic cups with cover. Just the usual packaging for milk tea. You'll see the name of the drink you order on the sticker placed on the side of the drink. They have the logo in front, which is very minimalist, just 11.11. On the top, you'll have your cover. This is the place where you can put the straw. And you can also remove this part the hard cover so you can drink directly from the cup if you like. At the back of the cup, you'll have the print here that says make a wish. The drink comes with their plastic straw and I can say that this straw is different from the other straw of the milk teas in the market because it's bendable. There you go. Usually, we get straws from other milk tea shops, but it's not bendable like this. So, this is the first time that I saw a drink specialty store with this bendable straw. Their drinks usually come in three layers. This is our coffee series, and they are three layers. This one is the pulpy series, and this one is their milk tea series. So, we got two from the coffee series, one from the milk tea, and one from the pulpy we can try their drinks and we can identify which one's gonna be our favorite now let's get on to the most important part of this video which is we're going to try the drink let's start with their coffee series and this is the sea salt americano comes in three layers so we have here the coffee and then their sea salt. For the Americano, this is more of the strong coffee. So for those who like their coffee strong, they suggest you try the sea salt Americano. For drinking, they mention that you have to mix the coffee first for you to enjoy that. So we're going to do that right now. I'm gonna try that now. I think coffee lovers will really like this. You can really taste the coffee, which is the strong one. So if you're into that type of coffee, then you're gonna love this drink. Again, this is the sea salt Americano. The next drink that we're going to try is their Sea Salt Cafe Latte. They recommend this for those coffee drinkers who likes their coffee sweet. Compared to the Americano, the Cafe Latte is much more sweeter. You mix the drink first to enjoy it. I think we were able to mix the drink already. Now we're going to taste the cafe latte. Mm. I love the cafe latte. I prefer the cafe latte more than the cafe americano because usually I like my coffee sweet. Since you have the sea salt mix, it gives you a different flavor, which is what I like on my coffee. 
Now, we're going to try their milk tea series. I got their classic milk tea. It also comes in three layers. You'll have here their plant-based sinker. So, plant-based meaning it's much healthier. You'll have here your milk tea. And then, on top of that, you will have there your sea salt whip. Similar with the other drinks, they also recommend that you mix all the three layers first so you can enjoy your drink well. So that's what we're gonna do now. This is how their sea salt whip looks like. Recommended to mix it as well first so the sea salt whip will incorporate on the milk tea. Now we're going to try their classic milk tea. So for the classic milk tea, you'll have here your milk tea taste but with a twist. It's not the typical milk tea that you'll have. Anything they also claim that for their drinks, they want it to be unique. For the sinkers, it's plant-based. It's not hard. It's soft. It's not very sweet like other milk tea with the cream cheese or with cheese on top. This has the right amount of sweetness. Final drink, we're going to try their pulpy series. So this drink is their lychee pulpy. So they have a variety of drinks on their pulpy series. They also have watermelon. Especially on their pulpy series, they don't use any powder. They use fresh fruits. And their sinker, similar to the milky series, they also use plant-based sinkers for this one. So I got the lychee, which is their favorite, I believe. So for this one, we're also going to mix the drink first so we can enjoy all the flavors incorporated together. This is how the cheese on top looks like for their pulpy series. The cheese on top of their pulpy series is kind of thick. So we're going to try now the pulpy series. For the pulpy series, you can really feel the fruity flavor of the lychee. So I guess, if you're the type of person who prefers a fruity drink, then you're definitely gonna love the pulpy series. They have variety of fruits. This has the evident lychee flavor with a hint of sweetness, but it's not too much. Going to try is their classic milk tea. So it has the plant-based sinkers, the milk tea, and then the sea salt whip. It's already mixed because I mixed it a while ago. They always recommend to mix their drinks first before consuming it. So the flavors will be incorporated. Okay, mommy, let me try it. What can you say about it? It's too yummy. What's your favorite? The milk tea or the pulpy lychee? Both of them. Yeah. Overall, I really recommend the 1111 drinks by Heidi and Hazel. I'm also happy that I was able to order today on their soft opening. My favorite on their menu would be the Sea Salt Cafe Latte and the Pulpy Lychee series. There you go guys! If you like this video, kindly give it a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Yay!